John Ostick, uh, an AP economics teacher in Malvern Prep in the Philadelphia area. And today, we have two Malvern Prep juniors who are going to go over the scoring rubric for the 2008 AP Macro question number two. So, the they're going to tell you that the economy is in full employment and long run equilibrium, so the economy is in the black. Probably it was in the red before, now it's in the black, okay? So, introducing Kyle Washkalovich, Simply Wash, and Chuck Andrus, our economist cover of the week, winner also of the year. Two time champ. savings in Uchland uh, will increase. Uh, there is an incentive to invest because of the uh, because of the lower tax um, and um, the government decreases the tax on interest earnings which increases consumption. Uh, what, what is interest what is the tax on interest bearing assets? What does that mean instead of our consumers, instead of spending their money for this year's economy, what are they going to do? They're, they're saving it for the future. And, and, okay, very good. Part B. Draw a correctly labeled graph of the mutual <coughs> funds market. Show the effect of the change in private savings identified in Part A on the equilibrium right real interest rate. So here we have the loanable funds market with the y-axis is real interest rates and the x-axis is the quantity. Um, and then the supply is upward sloping, and those are the savers, and the demand is downward sloping, and they are the borrowers. And here we have um, we have the original equilibrium price, and then the the shift in um, the 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 supply curve shifts to the right um, because of the increase in savers and supply, which. Um, so, 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 Charlie, the reason why there's an increase in the supply or savings from the original black equilibrium point is because of the because of the tax de change. De decrease in tax, yes, um, which lowers the real interest rate and increases the quantity. Part C. Given the real interest rate change identified in Part B, answer the following questions. Number one, what is the short run effect on aggregate <coughs> demand? So aggregate demand will increase, and the reasoning because of that, next to J.R. Byrne, um, he says here that the real interest rate is the rate of interest expressed in purchasing power. So when in real interest rates are higher, purchasing power is lower, and vice versa. And in this case, we have a tax, uh, we have an interest rate decrease in interest rates, so that means that um, people are able to spend more, which will increase aggregate demand. Part two, what is the long run effect on Potential real gross domestic product in Explain. So over here, first of all, the tax reduction um, was in order to try and increase um, the investment in capital goods. So with the increase in the investment in capital goods, that'll shift the production possibility curve outward and will increase production possibility. And with that shift of the uh, PPC, PPC curve, that will also shift the long run aggregate supply curve because capital goods are more investments for the future, like machinery and buildings and stuff like that. So that's a shift of the long run aggregate supply curve. And as the aggregate supply, long run aggregate supply curve shifts to the right, that increases real GDP on the x axis there. So who do we want to give credit to for having that poster? Ryan Dillon, PSU 22. And also, uh, we, you didn't mention it, but Lou, oh, Lewis. Here. We also got Ian Cullen, University of South Carolina. As I said here, J.R. Byrne, James Madison University. And over here, didn't use them, but great resource, Louis Margay of the U.S. Naval Academy. Showed the economy and long-run equilibrium where, it was the, where the, this whole question where began before the tax cut on interest investment assets. Okay, thank you guys very much. That is the scoring rubric that we predict for 2008 AP Macro question number two. Thank you guys for painting it very, very black. Thank you. Thank you.